A Santan Valley man originally charged with sexually assaulting more than a dozen underage girls could get out of jail as early as today. Team 12's William Pitts is live in the newsroom with why Tyler Cost will soon walk free despite being sentenced to three years behind bars. Well, Tyler Cost was facing sexual assault charges. His plea deal, though, had him pleading guilty to only three counts of child abuse and three counts of sexual conduct with a minor. That gave him three years in jail, but he could walk out at any time. You, Tyler James Cost, are one of the most disturbed, sick, demented human beings I've ever met. I remember consistently trying to speak to Tyler Koss victims wanted him to serve the maximum time. He was facing three to seven and a half years in prison. Prosecutors read letters from some victims. The impact my sexual assault had on me was devastating. My life changed forever. Koss family told the judge he's a great person, and his lawyers maintain that Koss was railroaded by a cabal of jilted high school girls. Tyler is a joy to know, love, and I'm proud to be a part of this life. Judge, Tyler's a good kid, and we ask that you allow him to come home to his family and let the healing process begin for everybody. We provided a binder, uh, and this is an exact copy, with all of the uh, exhibits uh, that call into question much of uh, what was alleged. Cost lawyers still maintain the girls were conspiring against him using Facebook chats like this one. We need to come up with a plan. He's going to feel the pain he put every girl through. The one person who didn't cite any of this, Tyler Cost. Your Honor, I want to apologize for my actions. I know that I made some serious mistakes, and I want you to know that I accept responsibility for what I did. I'm so sorry for the pain I caused everyone. After sentencing, Cost's lawyer blamed the media and the former sheriff and county attorney who brought the charges. A lot of the anguish that was caused to all of the people in this case related to the publicity. Even the new county attorney blamed former Sheriff Paul Babu and former county attorney Lando Voiles, who brought the case. The prior administration, in my opinion, wanted to treat him solely as an adult and say if an adult did this, this is the appropriate resolution. Again, Cost did not plead guilty to any sexual assault charges. Those were dropped. As part of the plea deal, though, he'll have to register as a sex offender and be on probation for 15 years. But he was also given credit for time served. So those three years are basically served. He could walk out at any time. William Pitts, 12 News.